Okay, so this is our Amazon face mask call. We actually ordered 15 face masks off Amazon. They were all four stars or above with, oh, I think at least a thousand reviews or quite a few reviews, some of the more popular face masks. So we were gonna try them on for you to let you know which ones were the most comfortable. But besides that, we're gonna run them through a couple of tests, but we don't wanna bore you with that. So we're gonna run the tests off camera keep track of the scores and then let you know the score as we try them on for comfort. The first test we're gonna do, I'm gonna use this disposable mask as a example. I'm sure you all know, are familiar with these as long as masks have been around. This is called the uh, oh, Bill Nye Science Guy candle test. You shouldn't be able to blow out a candle with the face mask. From a foot away which that just shows that your breath isn't getting far enough out to get on people if you do the social distancing so that's the candle test and then i'm also going to do an extra test with water because the uh, virus is actually spread with a uh, moist water droplets through the air so i just kind of drizzle some water over the mask and see if it runs off like even this disposable one's working really good. There's not any water getting through so you know it's safe so we'll add up those scores separate and you can Watch us try the mask on for comfort in the next clip. So we showed you what kind of tests we put the mask through and we already ran them through those tests and wrote down the score. We didn't want to bore you with those tests so my wife also put them through a fog test for her glasses. She said she wears glasses quite a bit. Yes. I actually have the, the masks pulled up on the computer here so yes. I can talk about them while my wife's trying them on. So the first one we're gonna do is called Block Mask that we ordered on Amazon. I'll let my wife try it on for comfort. Okay. I'm gonna get some of the details real quick. Okay. It was $14.99 on Amazon and it came in a pack of three. It says soft stretch reusable face mask, 43% polyester, 52% cotton, machine wash, air dry. Um, yeah, it's very comfortable. I would probably get up at a 5 out of 5 um, as far as the comfort goes. Um, the only thing that I found when I was wearing my glasses, though, is it was horrible um, with fog. So I would only give it a 1 out of 5 for um, the fog with uh, glasses. Can you add up the score then as we go? It is a very comfortable mask. I'm just trying to breathe through it hard because I have a polyester mask at work, but I think it's mostly polyester and I have a hard time breathing through it, but I I work in food service delivery, so that's another story. Definitely want to lean more towards the cotton side for a breathable face mask if you're going to be be working pretty hard during the day. So, But I'd definitely give it a five for comfort. And it's adjustable also, so oh, yep. away real quick. Yeah, that's the score real quick. What's the total score? So the total score for the block face mask that we just tried on would be a total of sixteen. If I know how to count right. <laughs> the next one is this armor all face mask. You guys are probably familiar with that brand. <laughs> Under it's Armor. The <laughs> Under Armor, my bad. It does come with a little carry case, so I might want to try that on while I, I mean, on you, you could do armor all, but I don't think that would be comfy. It oh. does come in different sizes because it's not adjustable. I do believe we ordered the... Yeah, this... While he's looking up some stuff, it is definitely um, very comfortable. I would definitely give it out of five for comfort. Um, when I had my glasses on, um, I actually gave it a 4 out of 5, um, for fog factor, because it just fogged up my glasses just a teensy, teensy little bit, but, um, it also did really excellent on the water test. Um, so yeah, this is definitely a really good face mask, um, to buy. It's definitely a unique face mask. It's definitely a five in comfort, really soft. As long as you order the right size for your face, it's not adjustable, but it's called a sports mask. 
It says plus ISO chill. Um, it says tear away for this tag, so you can just cut that off with scissors as soon as you get it. So yeah, I definitely give that five for comfort. So I'll let my wife give the total score while I look at it again real quick. Yeah, so overall, um, with our scores that we gave it for the candle, water, and glasses test, along with comfort, um, this one ranks a 19. Pretty sure this is going to be my favorite. It's it is extremely comfortable. Mm -hmm. It does say it is a hundred percent polyester, but it's kind of designed unique, mm -hmm. so it doesn't completely hug your face. So you can actually breathe hard in my line of work, and I think I could get away with this one, because uh, it's kind of like keeps you from sucking it in when you breathe. So, and that's it's, a big deal, even just in regular everyday work, not necessarily like heavy labor work but I mean yeah it makes a big difference to be able to breathe and not suck in your face mask while you're trying to breathe. Yeah I have a fanatics.com face mask that's polyester at work and when I breathe in it like sucks the whole mask against my mouth and it's mostly polyester so I just can't breathe good enough with it on but this one's a different story it won't let me suck it against my face so the air actually goes like mostly down or out from around the mask instead of through it and this one also got a star for the uh, water test. All these masks did pass the uh, water and candle test. You can't blow out a candle a foot away or even close. But uh, some of them like this one did get a star for the water test because the water just completely trickles off of it. It doesn't absorb any water. I think because it is polyester. Most of the cl uh, cloth masks will absorb a little bit of water but it won't go all the way through. So, And I don't know if I said yet but it is it says number one bestseller on Amazon in cloth face masks. <laughs> Four and a half stars out of out 8,113 ratings. Mm -hmm. So the next one is Cup Coats Kids face mask. I ordered one for kids just to try out for you guys. So I don't know if we can exactly try that one on for comfort, but. Yeah, I mean. I could try it, but <laughs> obviously it's not going to do much for me. Um, and obviously our daughter is only a year old, so I'm definitely not going to put this on her because she's too little. But, I mean, to me, if I was a little munchkin, I would think that this would fit really comfortable. I mean, it seems really comfortable for me, even though it looks silly because it doesn't <laughs> fit my face. So I'd probably give it a five <clears throat> for comfort. It does have a little wire to adjust over your nose, so that can help if your kiddo has glasses. If your kid has glasses though, be really careful because it um, fogged up my glasses pretty well. Um, so just be careful of that if you're going to order these. It says it's a... Uh... Looks like it's dual layer mask, so the outer layer it says it says 100% cotton inner layer, 93% polyester, 7% spandex outer layer. So that's good as far as not spreading water or droplets through the air with the virus, so can't really go wrong with that. It did not get a, a star for water resistance though, so anyways there you go. It's a uh, Four stars on Amazon out of 7,371 ratings. Can't really go bad with it. They're all Cubs face. They have a couple of different colors to choose from. Uh, there's the purple one. Here's the, I don't know, pinkish. You did, yes, pink. <laughs> you look kind of girly, but I guess your son might like one of them. Wow. <laughs> anyway, so on to the next one. Just trying to hurry so you guys don't get bored. Pretty hard to go wrong with these face masks as far as uh, spreading the, the virus if you do the social distancing and all that. Most of it's going to go by comfort, unless you have glasses, of course. The next one up is called Amazing Grace. So, I'll show you real quick. I was going to just say really quick, too, the Cub Coats kids, I mean, judging from our um, little rating system, they did only get a 16. Yes, this is the Amazing Grace face mask. And, I mean, it is really comfortable. Um, I just feel like there's 
definitely a lot of room in it, but yeah, I would definitely give it a five for comfort for sure. Um, if you wear glasses though, I only gave it a three because it did fog up my glasses pretty good, so, um, so yeah. <laughs> Okay, this one is adjustable. It's pretty easy to adjustable. It's got a unique, you just slide these rings back and forth. It is very easy to adjustable. Um, I mean, you literally grab it and slide the rings back and forth. The rings don't look very sturdy, but I am a guy, so. Mm. Seems really comfortable to me. So. Mm -hmm. It does suck the mask against my face a little bit if you breathe hard at work, but. Feels like it's cotton. Yeah, it's 100%. It says natural combed cotton, whatever that means. <laughs> Probably help if I Versus. took the mask off so I could talk. <laughs> it is $25 for four of them? Yeah. Yeah, there is four, four in here. Four of them for $25, so it yep. is a pretty good deal. Um, I don't see anything else special about it. But <laughs> they do come in uh, four different colors. Uh, they are very comfortable. Four and a half stars out of 3,025 ratings. So. Um, I probably forgot to give the price on some of the other ones, but I will put links in the description below the video for all these. So, on to the next one. So we would give The Amazing Grace a total score of 18. Next is a face mask called Simlu. I think it's one of the more popular masks out there. So, I will have to try that on. Why? Sounds interesting. <laughs> up here. I'll even jump ahead. These are adjustable as well. Um, that way he doesn't have to explain it. Or if he just does because he forgot. But yes, again, um, it's a very comfortable mask. Um, I like the fact that it hugs your chin down here underneath. Because some of the face masks that I've had in the past um, weren't comfortable and it just seems like I was always adjusting them. Um, I do see that I am, I can feel myself when I'm breathing in, it does um, suck into my face a little bit. So I would probably, comfort wise, probably go with a four. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, probably. I'd probably give it a four also because it does kind of dig into my neck down here when I've been done with my neck. So I know that could get annoying during the day. So probably four and a half for me. They do come in a three pack uh, reusable washable face mask. $11.99 for three of them. About four and a half stars on Amazon out of 7,180 ratings. And I do believe it's 100% cotton just from the yep. Just 100% cotton face mask. Not too much else special about it. What was the fog? Glass fog? Did you say yet? Or? I did not. It was only a... I gave it a 4. For fog. So, I mean, that's pretty good for that face mask. To give an actual... Be a 4 on the fog factor. So, you definitely don't... Wouldn't have to worry too much about that. What's the total score? Um, the total score for that one is 18. Okay, the next one is called Wedding Star. Sounds fancy. There's only one of them. <laughs> so. And this is also adjustable. And it does have the little um, flap in here to put a filter in there. And yeah, comfort wise, um, again, I would probably go probably go with a five actually it seems to be pretty comfortable um it also um got a, a four on the glasses test as far as um the fog factor but yeah i would definitely give this one a five for comfort yeah <laughs> yeah it's a really comfortable face mask it does have the nose wire to help it fit snugger to your face and it was only 764 for one of them so which isn't the greatest but it does have right at four and a half stars out of 15,363 ratings on Amazon's 
This is a pretty safe face mask to buy. What's it made out of? Oh, there we go. It just says cotton, so I think it's 100% cotton. There's no stars on it for water. Nope. Okay. And so the total, score? the total score for that one would be 19. Alright, next up is... This is this Our next up are the, oh, I want to say normal everyday disposable face masks that a lot of people have been using. We did actually test those, and as far as comfort, you can try it on. Yeah, let me try it once more, just in case. I think they're pretty comfortable, so. Yeah, I mean, they can definitely fit, I mean, pretty much any face. <laughs> I think that's why they made them that way. Um, so yeah, comfort-wise for me, I would definitely give it a five. Um. Glasses, like the fog test though, was only a three. Um, just because, yeah, every time I breathe, breathe out of my nose or mouth, my glasses fogged up, and that is definitely not very good, especially if you only wear glasses. Yeah, I definitely give it a five for comfort. Also, I've been wearing them for a while. I'm just trying to figure out what it's made out of. I don't think it's extremely important, but... Let me see... Anyway... See. I do, overall rating, we did give it an 18, though. So now let's see what's made up of here. <laughs> it just says... It's made from a supportive and powerful three-layered fabric for three-way filter. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. don't want to go on that for too long. <laughs> on to the next one. Moving on. The next one is... It's called Interplex. Uh, these ones were rather unique. I think this might be my favorite face mask. but. I mean, honestly, when I took it out of the package, I thought it looked like underwear for your face. <laughs> But they are extremely comfortable. I would definitely, yeah, comfort wise is definitely a five for me. Um, fog factor though, um, it only tested a three. Yeah, I definitely give it a five. Um, it did get a star on the uh, water test because uh, most of the face masks are cotton, so they'll absorb some water, but the water still doesn't get through to the next layer layer you did literally have to soak it from a heavy rainstorm or something being rain all day but these ones do tread water like it doesn't even absorb water in the front so it probably has some sort of a uh, water resistance and this is a large size since it's not adjustable you can uh, order them in different sizes we ordered the large it is $18.95 for three of them but I think it's worth it I think they're really really comfortable yeah. um, so what's the overall score? Overall score for Interplex was 18. And that's with a bonus for water resistance. Yes. If you are more worried about spreading the virus since it is spread by moist water droplets through the air. Yeah, I, that would definitely be another one on the list of, of good ones. Next ones are brand we all know, the Levi's Reusable Cloth Face Masks. They come in red, blue, and black, or you can even order a three-pack of different colors, I believe. Yay. They are $7.50 for a three-pack, which is a pretty good deal. Right at four stars out of 20,776 ratings on Amazon, so that's pretty safe. 100% cotton. Most definitely comfortable, so I would myself give it a five. And even fog factor, um, I gave it a four, so it does work pretty well with your glasses. Red one. They're pretty, they're very comfortable. I definitely give it a box. It does have a star for water resistance, because uh, it did not absorb any water. All the water trickled right off of it. It doesn't say, it says 100% cotton, but let's see it's got any special water resistance but we put it to the test so we know 
Let's see overall score. Overall score is a 19 for the Levi's. All right, next up is, looks like I believe, yeah. Eye Lily Cotton Double Layered Pattern Face Mask Washable Filter Lining Shield. So, oh, <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> now this is definitely an interesting one. I wasn't quite sure how it is adjustable. It <laughs> It is. The air loops. Yes. It's right at four and a half star out, stars out of 1,793 ratings on Amazon. I mean, comfort wise, I would probably. I don't know. I'd probably actually just give it a four. Um, it definitely was pretty miserable um, with the fog test for glasses. I actually only gave that a two. Does yeah, it have some sort of extra layer in the middle of it? It says washable filter lining shield. It is 100% cotton, so and there's no star for nope. resistance. So, I have to adjust it. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah, it's. Mm. Well, it's all right. I'm, I wouldn't really buy it for myself. I think it's a women <laughs> women's face mask from the design. <laughs> And the name, so I'm not really gonna rank it, rank it for comfort. I'll let my wife take care of that part. So. That's uh, just a sick. The price was $14.99 for one of them, so that's total score. Um, the total score for this one is only a 16. So, on to the next one. Thank you. Or whatever. I think. Yeah. Safe plus me is what it's called. Oh yeah, so this one is definitely interesting because I don't know if you can see this, but this actually, this strap goes behind your head. Um, I did not realize that until after we got it out of the package and I was like, oh, well this is going to be interesting. So bear with me here. It is, I've never worn one like this, as you can tell, because <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing. Okay. Um, honestly, comfort wise, I would probably go with maybe even a three, um, just because it feels like it's really digging into like my ears and that's obviously not very comfortable. You need to be comfortable if you're going to be wearing this for like eight to ten hours a day. Um, glasses, the fog test for glasses, I only gave it a three. So, yeah, here. <laughs> um, obviously, it's not adjustable. It's $9.99 for one of them. I believe we ordered the large slash extra large. It comes in different sizes because it's not adjustable. And put it on upside down. No, you did <laughs> Um, Maybe well, I since I'm a guy, I don't have all that hair in the back, so it's really comfortable for me. Um, oh, your ear just looks like it's getting... It's a little bit tight through here, though, so I'd probably have to get the next size up, but, uh, uh, I don't think I would mess with some of the face masks that aren't adjustable. This one's a little bit too tight for me, so you'd have to go through all the rigmarole sending it back. It's $9.99 for one of them, so yeah, I'm just gonna say right offhand I'm not a big fan. So I definitely want to buy that one. So overall I we would give it a 16. Next one up. That one was 60% cotton and 40% polyester. Next up it's called just called Universal. It's sold by Universal no. Sewing and Supply. No. Never mind, I got them out of order a little bit. The next one we tested was... Pauline. <laughs> yeah, however you say that. I don't know how you say that name. Right. Yeah. Anyways, next up is, it's called Aline Col Collection Made in USA Cotton Fabric Washable Face Mask. This is the Republic. I got them a little bit out of order here. There we go. 
Uh -huh. Here we go. Let's see what we got. So, it does have that little inner um, pocket, so you could put a little filter in there or even an extra, like one of those disposable face masks. It is $7.99 for just one of them. Mm hmm. 95% cotton and 5% spandex. Uh, comfort level for me would be a 5. Um, fog factor for glasses though is only a 2. It's right at 4.5 stars out of 8,100 8, ratings on Amazon. So. Mm. It's pretty comfortable, but it feels a little tight above my nose. Um, I definitely, I definitely give it a five for comfort. It is a really comfortable mask. So. so overall rating would be a seventeen for that one. So next up should be New Republic. It's called a New Republic face mask. So it comes in a three pack <laughs> for eleven ninety nine. Four stars out of. 23,179 ratings on Amazon, so it's not too bad. A lot of people ordered it. Yeah, these are just different than any of the other face masks that we've worn so far today. Um, I guess comfort-wise for me, I just don't like how it's so like close to my mouth um, that basically I am breathing it in every time I take a breath. So I would probably have to give it a three myself for comfort. And it did not pass the glasses test whatsoever. Um, it made my glasses extremely foggy, so I only gave it a one. All right. What do you think? This is New Republic. Yeah. I'll give it a five for comfort. It does. It did kind of suck it in when I was breathing, but it is really comfortable. I don't know if I said it's eleven ninety nine for three of them. I did say the rating. It's hundred percent cotton. So. So all in all, our test would give it a uh, 14. So what's next? Universal Sewing Supply. Next one is called Universal Sewing Supply. And I don't want to toot our horn, but this was our grand champion out of all the face masks that we tried today. <laughs> we'll click on it. It is 14.95 for. Four of the masks, so that's a pretty good deal. Right at four and a half stars out of almost 13,000 ratings on Amazon, so that's pretty good. So comfort-wise for myself, um, I gave it a five. Um, it actually passed the glasses test with a five. I didn't detect any fog on my glasses whatsoever, so that was a big bonus. Um, yeah, because most of the time I wear my Contacts, but yeah, if I had to um, wear my glasses, I would definitely pick this face mask to wear. Oh yeah, it's as <laughs> comfortable as it gets, plus it has a nose wire to keep it against your nose better. So that does help. I don't know if I said yet. Oh yeah, I already said the price. So let's yeah, so give the total score. Total score for this one is a 20. Like I said, this was probably our grand champion of all of the face masks that we What's have tried on so far one? today. Tart collection. Yes. Is that the last one? Yes. All right, last but not least, it's called Tart Collection. There's only one of them, but it did only cost $5.99. It does have a cool color. Tart blue with that black straps. The right one. Oh, no, this is what it's Mm-hmm. Oh, <laughs> Alright, let's try this again. <laughs> Still has a cool color. It does, yes. It comes in two different colors. Five ninety nine for one, I think I already said that. Comfort wise for me, I would give it a five. Um, but a glasses test I only gave it a three. It says hundred percent ring spun cotton, whatever that means. <laughs> You can order them in a three pack, I guess. Mm. Uh, yeah, it is pretty comfortable. I'd definitely give it a five as far as comfort just because it feels so soft and like firm against your face but not tight. So, you 
can't really feel it digging into my ears or anything. So I definitely give it a five. And I'm just gonna take a quick pause, and we're gonna go through real quick and pick out our favorite ones. <laughs> okay, so we each picked out our favorite mask. Oh, my wife forgot to give the total score for our tar collection face mask, so that's the one we reviewed. Yeah, uh, we gave it an overall score of 18. Um, but yeah, just like you said, we did pick out our favorites out of the list. Um, I chose the Universal Sewing Supply uh, face mask just because it was a 5 for comfort. It was a 5 for um, the fog test for glasses, um, along with the water and candle test. It, I mean, like I said, it was our grand champion. Um, but actually, my husband's pick would be my definite... Uh, second choice if I um, didn't pick this one. <laughs> and uh, mine was the Under Armour one. I think I put it on wrong earlier. The Under Armour symbol actually goes down. And it's just a really thick mask with a uh, water resistant outer layer, outer layer so you know you're not going to get any moist water droplets in. It even has a nose band up here so you might want to go grab your glasses real quick and test it again since we had it on wrong. <laughs> I think this band will help a lot. It did say it's the number one selling cloth face mask on Amazon. But I just really like how it's really soft but it's structured in a way to where it keeps it out away from your mouth so you can actually breathe in and out and you're not going to suck the mask in. And I work extremely hard at work. I work up quite a sweat so I'm breathing really hard and uh, this one's just really comfortable, soft and breathable. It is a sports mask, so obviously that will make a big difference for a guy. I think it would be a great mask for working out as well if you go to the gym and stuff. Just overall for a heavy breather, if you work up a sweat, you can't beat this un under armor face mask. <laughs> but my wife's going to do a fog test on it again real quick. Yeah, so just bear with me. Check, so. Yes. Since, like you said, we there's a good chance we had it on wrong <laughs> when we were testing it out earlier. Alright, because before I believe I gave it a 4 um, out of 5 for the fog factor. Um, I would still probably keep it at maybe even like a 4.5 out of 5. Um, just because I barely see just a tiny little bit um, when I breathe out, but it quickly dissipates. So I can't really, I mean it isn't going to be obstructing your view or anything like that for any lengthy period of time so but yeah there you go and i'll put a link to all these face masks in the description below the video thanks see you later